Bila shaka kipindi hiki kina dhamini wa pakubwa sana na benki ya Cooperative Bank bila wasiwasi ni kwako sasa kutoa majukumu yako kujipatia nafasi ya kile ambacho umeelezewa na ngine hapa lakini swali langu sasa kwako John ni kuhusiana na swala la bei. Je, bei sasa hivi inaonekanaje? Na vile vile swala gumu ambalo najua watu wengi wanajiuliza ni kwa nini mkulima asikwende moja kwa moja afanye mauruji au export peke yake bila kupitia processes? Uh, yeah, uh, what I would say about um, uh, the prices, in fact, uh, since the, the Minister for Agriculture did lift the ban of export of uh, Inshel, in fact, uh, the prices stabilizes. Mm -hmm. And from that... Here we are talking about the former minister. Yeah, the former minister, right. uh, Honorable uh, Linturi. Mm -hmm. And um, in fact, uh, while, while they were lifting the ban uh, for those two years, there was um, th there was a condition we were given uh, by the minister himself. Mm -hmm. We must buy macadamia at, at not less than 100 shillings. And, uh, and of course, we did. Uh, but uh, but, but uh, the processors, me included, I, I, I could not make it to, to buy at 100 because of the, the, the production costs. Mm -hmm. uh, those who were able, like me, because I'm flexible, uh, I was able to export. I had a market for the, uh, for the dry in shell, macadamia nuts, mm -hmm. and I could export, mm -hmm. and I could get some profits. Mm -hmm. So from there, in fact, we had even buying macadamia uh, at 120 right now as we are talking. Mm -hmm. And I challenge you to talk to farmers mm -hmm. in Nyeri, in um, Ebu, in Meru, uh, and, and everywhere mm -hmm. uh, where macadamia is grown. Uh, you will hear from the host mouth that uh, we are buying at 130 shillings. All right. So the prices have become more stable. It is stable. Right. Kuna, now the biggest... Kuna, 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 kuna ilo swali ambalo nimeuliza kama mbona tusifanya moja kwa moja kusafirisha ngambo. Yeah. In fact, uh, that is the same question I asked myself. Why, why, should, uh, why should a farmer be denied uh, that opportunity of uh, exporting himself? And it is a very, very simple, uh, simple assignment to do some dryers in his farm, mm -hmm. dry at uh, 1.8 moisture uh, level, and then put it in a, in a nylon bags. Mm -hmm. Very, very, very simple task. And then he exports. But, uh, but uh, there is this challenge uh, where the, the, the AFA or the NUCD, mm -hmm. not at the oil crop, you have to be to be given a uh, export license, mm -hmm. processing license. I have it myself. Mm -hmm. uh, and they still, they have to inspect your facilities. And in fact, my argument even uh, was that I would uh, challenge the, the incoming Minister for Agriculture. Uh, why are they giving out uh, uh, the export license and uh, manufacturing license to, 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 to briefcase business pe people? Mm -hmm. Whereby they have nothing to chew. All they right. don't have the facility. Uh, that is where even the, 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 the industry and the value chain is going wrong. Right. Because when you are, you, you, you are, you are briefcase business, uh, businessman, you can uh, get a market, you, you can uh, ask for a market from abroad. Mm -hmm. Then you can buy even body nuts from uh, other processors. Uh, do you spoil uh, the, the market? Right. Now, when we speak on edible oils, which is a big conversation right now, what will it take for us to start processing edible oils, given that we are growing high oil crops like the macadamia? What is standing in between that? Uh, that, is, uh, that is also my, 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 my question I was asking. Mm -hmm. Why don't we have, have macadamia oil uh, in a supermarket shelves? Mm -hmm. Right now you cannot find macadamia oil in the, uh, in the supermarket shelves. Mm -hmm. Neither will you get macadamia butter uh, in those shelves. Mm -hmm. uh, why? In fact, um, last week I was in Guangzhou and uh, Hanan cities. I had gone there, uh, I spent there for 14 days. I had gone there to, to check for affordable machines mm -hmm. for, 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 for doing oil. Mm -hmm. And I got mm -hmm. uh, a very cheap machine. Mm -hmm. And I got even another one for, for, for processing uh, the butter. Mm -hmm. 
but as much as the machines are cheap in China, the excise duty, the importation duty is so high that eh, you cannot be able to, 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 to cheap uh, in the country those machines. Dirango, maybe give us some figures so that we can compare and see which part of that really does discourage that person who wants to get into mechanization. Maybe you can tell us what, you, what price you saw for the machine and after the taxes are added into it, what price it came to. Yeah, for the for the for the squeezing oil, uh -huh. we got a machine of four hundred thousand uh -huh. shillings. Uh -huh. But when it comes to the shipment uh, under the taxes, in fact, it it it, it was a slice. Thrice. Yeah. Over one about one point two. Yeah, about one point two right. when uh, it reached here. That one for 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 the for the for the macadamia butter mm -hmm. it was 300,000 Kenya shillings mm -hmm. uh, to get it light at, uh, at your factory uh, you pay uh, about uh, 1 million mm -hmm. so we are unable the government should come in mm -hmm. and uh, actually uh, re regulate mm -hmm. the, 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 the income tax All right. so that most of the people can produce can produce oil and can make butter All right. yes right. Sasa so, kabisa umeeleza kwa undani na naamini kwamba yule mtu mbaya angependa sana kufanya kuleta ile machine katika taifa la Kenya basi hata jukumika. Ngina. Ni wakati wako sasa kwa <laughs> Yeah, it's time to of course we've come to the end of the show and we always have to wrap it up with the farm joke of the day. The question we're asking is what is the jam that you cannot eat? Mr. Ndirango, what is that? Yeah, it is traffic jam. <laughs> And the answer, of course, is traffic jam. Mm -hmm. Good stuff, Mr. Ndirangu. You are very, yeah, very watcha, right. Watcha Claps for you. Yeah. Oh, present for you. Yeah. <laughs> we'll make sure there's one for you next time. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah na ukumbuke kwamba tatimiza ndoto haijalishi mbali wa mto maji lazima tuyafikisha nyumbani now we have come to the end of the show another show well done and secured in the bag thank you so very much mr ndirango for yeah, being you. generous with your time you. and knowledge as well we'll most definitely keep having these conversations in order to streamline the sector thank you so very much for the team that is working on this entire production to make it as good as it does look we say a very big thanks and finally a view for choosing to be with us every single day of the week we say a very big thanks we'll see you again tomorrow and we will be going all the way to Lake Trukana to get some fish are we going to get anything the only way for you to find out is tuning in again tomorrow thank you for watching my name is Violeta Angina goodbye <laughs>